heard a song called The Touch of the Master's Hand. You know, we get to thinking sometimes that it's, that it's not just the master, it's us. And rather than respond to him, we try to do things for him. And sometimes it's just his touch. About no fiddle. Well, it was battered and scarred and the auctioneer felt it was hardly worth his while to waste much time on the old violin. So he held it up with a smile. He said, it sure ain't much, but it's all we got left. I guess we ought to sell it too. Now who'll start to bid on this old violin? Just one more and we'll be through. And he cried, one, give me one dollar. Who'll make it two? Only two dollars, who'll make it three? Three dollars twice, well, that's a good price, but who's got a bid for me? Raise up your hand, don't wait any longer, the auction's about to end. Who's got four, just one dollar more, to bid on this old violin? Well, the air was hot. And the people stood around as the sun was setting low. From the back of the crowd, a gray-haired man came forward and picked up the bow. He wiped the dust from the old violin, tightened up the string, and played out a melody pure and sweet. Sweeter than the angels sing. And the music stopped, and the auction here, in a voice that was quiet and low, said, Now what am I bid on this soul? Two thousand who will make it three. Three thousand twice, well, that's a good price. But who's got a bid for me? And the people cried out, What made the change? We don't understand. And the auction is stopped, and he said with a smile, It was the touch of the master's hand. cheap to a thankless world much like that old violin then the master comes and the foolish crowd they never understand the worth of a soul or the chains that is wrought by the touch of the master's hand he cried one give me one thousand who we'll make it two only two thousand who will make it three. Three thousand twice, now that's a good price. But who's got a bid for me? The people cried out, what made the change? We don't understand. The auction stopped, and he said with a smile, it was a touch of the master's hand.